Tomorrow, Gulf Coast State College, they're hosting their Super Saturday event at both of their campuses. So News 13's Ethan Lowe, well, he headed to Gulf Coast State College in Panama City this morning to tell us more about what we can expect, which is a great event for current and even prospective students for Gulf Coast. Good morning. Good morning, Kelsey. And again, that's right. At both the Port St. Joe and Panama City Gulf Coast State College campuses tomorrow, there will be hosting the Super Saturday event. Now in the Panama City campus, that will be between 9 and 11 a.m., while at the Port St. Joe campus, that will be between 10 to noon. And again, these times are central times because you got to keep in mind that the Port St. Joe campus, well, they're in Eastern time. So keep that in mind if you do plan on stopping by. But joining me one last time is Jason Hedden to talk more about what people can expect to see and do tomorrow. So Jason, first and foremost, who's going to be stopping by and who can parents and prospective students talk to? Well, we hope everyone's going to stop by, you know, hundreds of people. No, we'll see. Um, Super Saturday is a one-stop shop for us, so it's not too late if you're planning to attend or thinking about attending fall classes at Gulf Coast, which start August 21st. Uh, what we're going to do is we're basically bringing everybody for all the vital offices across campus into one building uh, for the morning on Saturday, just to make it easier on folks. Maybe you can't get here during the week. So we'll have representatives from enrollment services, from advising, from financial aid, from veteran services, student accessibility resources. If it's, if it's relevant to students and their time here, we're going to have a representative here for students to talk to. Now, the application fee is dropped for tomorrow, correct? Yeah, so if you've not applied to the college, it's 10 bucks, but hey, you know, right? That's, that's half a coffee, right? Yeah. Uh, so $10, if you want to save that 10 bucks, we're going to waive that fee tomorrow. If it was me, honestly, I would actually go ahead and apply today so that you're more prepared for tomorrow. And if you see me and I said, come see me tomorrow in person, and I'll, I'll, I'll personally give you that 10 bucks back. That's my guarantee. It'll just help us be more prepared for you um, either way. And speaking of preparation, are there any important documents that maybe parents of students or students themselves should bring tomorrow? Sure. In order to uh, document, uh, prove Florida residency for tuition purposes, we've got the lowest tuition in the state. Uh, even our out-of-state tuition is pretty darn affordable when you look at uh, tuition across, across the country. But if you're planning on um, doing that, go ahead and bring those important documents with you. Social Security card, uh, birth certificate, anything, um, utility bill, anything that will prove your Florida residency. And that information is also on the Gulf Coast website. So again, you can go to the Gulf Coast website for all that information. We'll also have that information up on our very own website, mypanhandle.com. And again, tomorrow's event between 9 and 11 at the Panama City campus and 10 to noon at the Port St. Joe campus. Kelsey.